Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Dom and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get the Nova Mortis and the Abaddon, also known as the Void Lord and Solar Lord. But before we get into that, if you guys are watching this on the Triton Army channel and do enjoy this video and content, feel free to go down in the description box below, check the link under my name and come check me out. But with that being said guys, let's just get into it. So basically what you guys want to do is just get to rank 7 on your record book, the dawning book. And um, you can either do SRL or you could do some strike scoring, you know, get some medals, 20 medals or the rainbow medals. Or you can do the 25 completes on the races or pass through gates. But that's what you want to do, you want to get to rank 7 and what you're going to redeem is called a Zer tag. Zer's tag and what it actually does is lets you open up the box that's right there on the stairs by where iron banner used to be on the tower and just make sure you open this with a warlock do not open this with a titan do not open it with a hunter and why i say that is because for the quests that come to follow it is easiest to do it on a warlock and you do not want to do this on any other character just because it will be difficult so once you go ahead and open up this box what it's going to give you is the quest line for the Nova Mortis and what you have to do is just go to talk to Ikora Ray that's just gonna tell you that you have to go talk to Banshee Banshee which is the gunsmith go over to Banshee talk to him and he's gonna tell you that you need a bunch of void kills now once you're done with these void kills you can do them in any activity doesn't matter where you do them now once you get these void kills you're just gonna have to go back to Banshee and then he's gonna tell you that you have to go ahead and jump in to the abomination high strike now this is Fogoth but this is the hardest version this is the abomination heist so once you complete that all you have to do is just go to Ikora Ray, and then she'll give you your lovely Nova Mortis it's basically the Thunder Lord just a void version which people usually call it the Void Lord now moving on to the Solar Lord aka the Abaddon and how you get this is once you complete the Ikora Ray quest you just want to walk over to Zavala and basically what he's going to give you is the Abaddon quest line and the first thing you're going to need to do is of course talk to Banshee once again Banshee is going to tell you to get some solar kills now with a warlock you could either run some solar grenades what I did is I just went to the uh, the dark below which is one of the story missions on the moon and you can just go ahead throw a bunch of nades at Thrall or whatever they're going to keep spawning if you don't complete the quest in that time you could just you know kill yourself and then um, just come back to life and keep throwing nades at the thralls until you beat it you only have to I think it's like a hundred kills a hundred solar kills so that's pretty easy this uh, these quests are not difficult at all but once you're done with that you can go ahead and go back into the tower talk to Banshee once again and then what he's gonna tell you is that you have to actually go and do the shield brother strike now once you complete the shield brother strike you're gonna get yourself the lovely Abaddon so this is how you get the two guns, the Nova Mortis and the Abaddon. They're actually very, very lovely. I do enjoy these. I can't wait to use the Solar one. And I can't wait to use the Void one. I haven't tested any of these out yet. But obviously they're just like the Thunderlord, our lovely Thunderlord. And if you guys don't know, the Thunderlord actually has a hidden perk, which is Firefly. But anyways, guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. I hope you did enjoy this tutorial. If you guys do want to see more, you can come check out my channel. Anyways, comment your thoughts. What do you think about these two guns? Uh, is the grind too much to get to rank 7? I don't think it is in my opinion, but let me know your thoughts. Subscribe if you're new. And as always, my name is Dom. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.